Hello and thanks for joining me for another week with Miri's Dream Time Messages. My name is Miri and I'm the artist um, painter behind Art by Miri that you've seen on Facebook or one of the social media channels, YouTube or Instagram. And so the week is, we're starting a brand new week and it's the full first week of June and so, you know, winter is here in Australia now and so that'll run for three months of cold weather and so, yeah, I love the sunshine so I'm really looking forward to spring coming uh, already but, you know, it's kind of been some warm uh, temperatures at night time that I'm feeling coming through already and so I'm pretty happy about that and so you know um, it's best to always look on the bright side of any given situation and you know it'll take you far and you know if you would have received the newsletter that was out um, only last from last week then you would have got a free copy of the six affirmations um, for a rebirth with the white cockatoo and so if you've been listening to those um, you know that's really great it'll help you to um, break through any negativity that you feel like has been holding you back um, and so you know I always find the best thing to do with those affirmations is to say them every single day for the next 30 days and you'll find that when you reach the 30th day that you would have uh, it's probably a good time to reflect and look back on the things that have been changing for you because of those affirmations that you've been saying every day and so yeah I highly recommend that you try them and you'll start to see the changes, the evidence of the changes that come through for you and they'll come through for everyone very differently and you know so um, that's what makes these affirmations so great and you know if you want to dive deeper into those affirmations the information, a lot of the information has come about from the dream time cards and the dream time guide that comes and the dream time guide book that comes with the card deck it's a little hundred page booklet which i will be making into um, a separate product uh, into a full-size book so if you're not really into the cards but you love to read the information then yeah i will be um, releasing that book um, soon i haven't got a definite date though so um, so yeah and it has some wonderful information in that booklet um, when I do bring it out and so stay tuned for the release date of that one so as I mentioned it's a brand new week starting the 5th of June and running until the 11th of June and so um, we pulled the two cards out which was the white cockatoo and so hence we released those affirmations um, you know, it's 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 about you know leaving the past behind and breaking through the negative um, chatter and also the negative beliefs that we were made to believe from the past because of certain experiences, and so it's really about just breaking through. And the other card that we pulled out was with um, the blue wren. I am love, letting you know that nature. And the dream time the universe is all letting you know that you are loved and you know if there's anything negative based to do with that card it's to do with releasing hate and anything that is there um, to do with um, you know any sabotaging belief systems the um, blue wren is about anything that's opposite to do with love and so you know love is the highest vibration you know we all want to achieve that in this lifetime and it's something to reach always in every single thing that we're doing and so yeah that's basically what the blue wren is and when you go into nature you'll you'll hear its high pitch sound and you know they congregate in families and you know the you can read much more information about this on the longer video that I put out every Sunday 
or you know you can grab yourself one of the card decks that are on the online store at artbymary.com.au and so I had, had a great week last week the full moon was on Sunday and so it was a good time to let go as well of any of these um, negative belief systems through meditation quiet contemplation uh, or just any kind of form of relaxation it could be walking to the park or spending some quality time in nature as well and so let's get started um, on this um, brand new week and let's have a look and see especially with those two powerful cards that we pulled out this week it's going to be really good to see